Hi, my name is Avina, and I'm a PhD student in the Computer Vision Lab at Michigan State University. I'll be presenting my work, Seabird Segmentation in Bird's View Improves Monocular 3D Detection of Large Objects. This is a joint work with Yuliang Guo, Xin Huang, Lei Yuren from Bosch Research North America, and Xiaoming Liu at Michigan State University. Large object detection is considered harder problem. And most accidents involve some large object or the another. We quantitatively benchmark SOTA detectors on the new scenes data set and find that their performance is indeed lower compared to the overall performance. Two possible reasons have been suggested in the literature. One being the training data scarcity because large objects are rarer compared to other objects in the AV data sets. The next reason being larger receptive field requirements of these large objects. So we wanted to know if the training data scarcity is the real problem. So we take another data set, which is a recently proposed KT360 data set. This data set has nearly balance ratio of large objects and cars. We find that SOTA frontal KT detectors are bad even on balanced KT360 data set. So that means that data scarcity is not the whole true reason for this performance. We can conjecture that convergence is a function of the representation, loss, and noise and monocular 3D networks are sensitive to large noise from larger objects. We find that dice loss outperforms regression losses under large noise from large objects. Based on our theoretical findings, we propose the Seabird pipeline. Seabird pipeline takes BV features and appends BV segmentation head and 3D detection head sequentially. It trains BV segmentation first with the dice loss and then fine tunes BV segmentation and the 3D detection heads. We next benchmark the performance of Seabird pipelines on the KT360 dataset and find that Seabird pipelines reach SOTA performance on this dataset. Seabird pipelines also outperform frontal detectors and even old LiDAR based detectors. The biggest improvement shows up on the large objects. We next benchmark the performance of the Seabird pipeline on the new scenes dataset and find that Seabird pipelines further improve the BV based detectors such as BEV first and HOP. The biggest improvement again shows up on the large objects. So the key takeaways is large object detection is a representation and a loss problem. The frontal detectors, even with transformers, do not work. BV detectors are suboptimal, but they can be improved by noise robust dice loss. And dice loss is better than regression losses under large noise which benefits large objects. Our code and the demos are all up. Please feel free to check them out. Thank you.